What's up guys, it's the only ninja wearing eight gears and a superhero hat bringing you another video here on the Modern Ninja channel and this is going to be the first tutorial Saturday here in Avatar Month and because I've already done air, water, earth, and fire last month, I'm going to start this month with something a little bit different but still in the Avatar world. We're going to be starting with chi blocking, yes a real life chi blocking move that you can do to you know anybody trying to hurt you so sit back relax and run that intro now first you got to know a little bit about the human body now our brain needs oxygen to survive it 100 percent relies on oxygen a constant supply of oxygen and that's why you have a giant uh, artery, actually two giant arteries, right on the side of your neck that carry blood from your heart pumped to your brain because that's how your brain gets oxygen. Now, if you stop it from carrying that blood to your brain, it will, depending on how long you stop it for, it can give you anything from some weakness to straight up dropping somebody. Now, in order to hit this spot correctly, I suggest using your knife hand, which is this part of your hand right here, and tensing it up and making it solid so that you can hit things without your fingers going across, without your you know thumb being loose. Have it all tight and hitting with the side of that hand just like that. Basically a karate chop, just, you know, I'm explaining how to do that. Now, what, what you're gonna aim for is right around what I call your necklace level. It's basically the point where if you were wearing a normal necklace, not, you know, a super big chain or anything like that. If you were wearing a normal necklace, it's where your necklace would sit. Ironically, Ironically, or luckily, it is actually for me where my shirt line is. Obviously, shirts are different, so it's not always going to be that for every shirt I wear, every shirt somebody else wears that attacks you, but that's going to be the target for where you're hitting, above the collarbone and at the bottom of the neck. Now, you're going to want to take your hand. Now, you're going to want to take your hand. But you're going to want to take your hand and then you're going to want to strike that area of the body. Now, I'm not going to do this to myself and I don't have any friends around willing to let me do it to them. So instead, I'm going to show you clips of people doing it correctly. Now again, guys, be aware this is very dangerous and depending on how hard you hit somebody and how effective your strike is, you can make them collapse, you can make them hurt themselves while they fall, maybe cracking their head or breaking some other part of their body because they fell, or you can even kill them if you hit it too hard um, in certain situations. So be very careful, this is a more of a last resort type of situation, but if you need to stop someone from attacking you and you can't and nothing else is working this is a good one to try that can work against basically everyone because we all have carotid arteries and we all have brains that need oxygen that's just you know how life works so with that said guys I hope you enjoyed this video if you are enjoying Avatar Month definitely check out the rest of the videos in the series but until next time my name is DJ Moore this is the Modern Ninja and I'm out